guys. What's up? I fluffed out the hair. I separated all of the water wave curls and I got this look. I started separating them because they were getting, um, what, what is a good example of what they were getting like? They were getting like this. Kind of limp and just whack looking and clumpy and nappy. So I figured, hey, since you want to be nappy, just go out and be nappy. And I love it. Ooh, I was dancing in here earlier, if you couldn't tell. And I just worked up a little bit of a sweat, so excuse me. But this is the look that I got from it. Cute, right? I know. I'll show you how I did it. Here is, I was, where's the one I was going to use? This one. So pretty much a lot of the hair is, uh, was like this. Very yucky looking and not really defining anything. I'll move back. So what I did was, well, let me move up actually to show you better. Whew. I peeled them out like that. So you take a little piece and you pull it out gently. That light behind me is not helping. But you pull it gently. I'll show you again. You take a piece and you pull it. Oh, my battery's dying. Okay, I'll fix that later. And you pull. And you pull. Now you will get knots. So don't be afraid of those. Just cut them off. This is for a very thick, bushy style to pull them out in those really thin rows. I'm sorry you can't see that. Uh, Let me do it this way. Yeah, that helps a little bit. Okay. So this knot right here, I wouldn't even try to combat that. I'll just cut it off and cut off over there too. And once again, go back here and just keep pulling it apart. Just like you would pull apart anything that's stuck together, really. Um, so I'm going from here and I'm pulling it up and up, up and up. And this clump right here, that's going to get cut because that's going to lead to more stupid tangles later on. The other piece we're working on this one. Alright, so we're pulling and we're pulling. And you're not going to, um, the only way you can bring it out of its shape is if you pull it too hard because it will just be straight. But if you pull it out gently, it'll assume the corkscrew curl. So right now I'm rocking with like a, a 3C for this is like three three B three B three C thing going on and I like it so still pulling and pulling and pulling and pulling now that was two pieces feel free to do more than to, to do one piece at a time it'll take a while but yeah and I I'm not even done yet I still have some more to do in the front but I have to go out and handle some business so they don't look that bad, so I'll just leave them. And uh, there's that piece. I can save that. I'm still pulling out from it. Um, and I'll just tap that end piece off just to do that. And there that piece is. We just fluffed it out. Uh, that knot is going to get cut. See right there? It feels funny, so I'm going to chop that off. And that's that. Ooh. Why is this thing so white? <laughs> I will go outside like this. Um, mm -mm. Sweating. Hold on. Yeah. Just like this. I gotta go to my school and then register for some more classes and pay them the money I don't have. And this is how I will tell them that I'm broke. Ma'am, I don't have any more money for you. I'm and I'm paying for an internship too, which is stupid, but... Hopefully, it's not the case. It's what I think the case is going to be. That was the case for the summer. When was it an internship? Oh, you have to pay for the summer class as an internship, even though they're making you do work for free. Yeah. But stay in school. Go to college. It is fun. All right. So the front of this, this, this whole top piece has not been separated yet. It's just fuzzy. So I'm just going to lay that back over. And it looks like that. I don't have to worry about keeping the front down or as neat anymore because the whole head is very uh, free and fluffy 
so it's not a it doesn't have to be slick straight it could if I wanted to achieve that look but I'm not trying to I don't want to put more attention or more gel in that area I'm just touching up that because that's kind of curled so you know do what you want have it how you want but this is the water wave free trust same exact hair just separated and you get this look from it this is the front of it this is the side this is the back. This is the other side. And that's that. Maybe I should do that closer. That's the back. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm out. I'll see you guys uh, next week. I plan on keeping this hair in for... Oh, this is like the second week of August. Uh, up until the week before the last week of August. So for two more weeks, I guess, and then I'll be putting in yarn braids for the fall. I'm just coming back to show you guys the styles that I'm doing with that. I'm that was that's the the easiest low maintenance, low itch, low low tension on my hair, moisture keeper style ever. I don't understand people say that yarn braids dries out the hair. It doesn't dry out my hair it, at all. As long as I spray my moisturizer on the length of the hair, on the length of the yarn where my hair is. It's fine. I've literally washed my hair at times and uh, taken the braids out to tighten them and my hair would still be sopping wet because the water would soak up into the yarn and, you know. Alright, that's my video for today. Uh, yeah, I'm, I am having a lot of itchies. I didn't, um, I did not wash the crochet hair in apple cider vinegar because I feel like I didn't need to, but it was still going next to my scalp, so I should have done that. So if you have a lot of problems with, with itching and stuff, definitely what do the apple cider vinegar it helps a bunch this is like I said water and aloe vera um don't spray anything on the hair because it kind of leaves your hands in this filmy way so I know before I say I was spraying this on it and it did make it soft at first but after a while it just when it dried it felt kind of gross so I've stopped doing that I'm just leaving it alone maybe spray water on it maybe but it's not necessary. Just leave it. Let it be. It's, it's synthetic hair. And synthetic hair will do what it wants. I slept with this in um, a tight do-rag cap. Not a bonnet, but something, you know, the tighter ones, uh, the fitted caps. So this is what it was. I don't expect to see any tangling from it. I don't, I'm not going to do anything drastic to it, like braid it. This is just what it is, and I'm happy with it. I love how the color just pops here and there. I got to get my eyebrows done again. And I will see you guys next week later